Inside 10 to go. Kyle Larson has led 267 of 315 laps today. Had to check up a bit for that lapped car of Joey Gase. And Blaney charges forward. Here we go. Now Blaney's car just it just looks like it's doing what he needs it to do right there. I mean, he ran the bottom of five of Larson, ran the top. Blaney still closed in on him. All right, let's listen to Kyle Larson's spotter. Oh, Blaney worked that high line perfectly right there. Big time. Here he is. Looking to the inside. Whoa, lead change and almost a collision. But will it stick? Well, now with the 22, affect the 12. Teammate of Ryan Blaney oh. coming right here with a lap car. I, I just wow. see the five car going away. Yeah, you know, he talked about the grip level of his car on that last stage and how it really fell off at the end. Needed some overall grip is what he said. You can see it right now. And you saw right there, Logano moved up the racetrack to let his teammate and Kyle Larson go on by. Yep. Now Ryan Blaney leads for the fourth time today. With seven laps to go. A few moments later. Hold on. But Jeff, he's been good all day. Kyle Larson's been great all day. But Blaney and that number 12 team, they were they had the second fastest pit stop of the year to get him the lead. And he's just been very, very consistent. And here he is. And Mike, that's why we race. You we, yes. we race every lap. It's never over till it's over, as we're proving right here again. And if you're Kyle Larson, you're surrounded in Pinsky. <laughs> He's got Ryan Blaney, both of Ryan Blaney's teammates right in between. Tough one to swallow if you're Kyle Larson. Dominated this race, only to get past inside of 10 to go. Very, very frustrating. And the sun pops back out for these final two laps. 14 cars on the lead lap. And here's your white flag. One lap to go. Sponsored by Credit One Bank. Third generation star. 27 years old from High Point, North Carolina. One last June at Talladega. Previous best finish here for it. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Did not see this coming at all. Ryan Blaney wins the Folds of Honor Quick Trip 500 in a shocker after Kyle Larson dominates the day but finishes second. Nice win there for Crew Chief Todd Gordon also. Mike, you said it. He was up in the booth for both races, truck race and the Xfinity race. Whatever he learned up here, he applied it right there in those closing laps. That is the most excited I have ever <laughs> heard YRB, young Ryan Blaney. Well, he's got plenty to be excited about. A few moments later. Balance. I talked about it all day long. It's so important to have that balance on your race car. Keep from leaning on one end or the other. <laughs> he led 25 laps today, including the last one. <laughs> Regan? Brian Blaney hopping out of the car to salute the fans. Grabbing the checkered flag after a long day's work and uh, fixing going to make find a fan's a day right here. <laughs> young fan with the Ryan Blaney shirt on. Oh, cool. Awesome. Yeah. 
Making memories, uh, Ryan, on the racetrack and off the racetrack. We get to the end of the race. All of a sudden, your car came to life. You guys worked on this car all day long. At the end of the race, it was the best car. Yeah, you know, we, um, gosh, we had a great long run car all day. It took us a little bit to get going, and I was pretty free all day. Um, and so we, we, you know, we made a really good change to tighten me up where I needed it. And it looked like Kyle was getting loose. And uh, it just, I'm happy it worked into our favor that there was a couple long runs at the end that let us kind of get there. And um, he got stoved up behind some lap traffic, but uh, really proud of this whole, you know, body armor, Menards, number 12 group, man. We've been good this year and had some bad breaks and it's nice to uh, close out a race like that. That was awesome. Did a very nice job closing the race out. I got to ask you though, you were in the Fox booth for two races yesterday. Was <laughs> it what you learned in the booth with us that uh, was able to propel you to victory? Oh, definitely. I might have to start doing it every week, I guess now. But, uh, <laughs> you know, thank you all uh, for coming out. It's awesome to see fans again. It's really cool. But, uh, you know, thank you, Body Armor, Menards, Ford, uh, <laughs> Dex Imaging, Advanced Auto Parts for what they do. We couldn't do it without them. And uh, looking forward to, uh, <laughs> sliding around a little bit more next week at Bristol.